Here is the picture round. How many of the following films do you recognise? You get one point for the name of the film and one point for the year that the film was released. If you want to enter the raffle and you haven't already done so, please enter your quiz name and your name onto the chat function below. The main quiz will be starting at 8.30. This is your two minute warning. The quiz will start in two minutes. Oh yeah, welcome back to another LR Leisure uh, quiz. Thank you very much for joining us. Um, it's the same concept as normal, so you've already had the picture round. Um, we're going to start with our general knowledge round. We've then got a few other rounds, including the specialist round that was voted for by you over on our Facebook page, uh, followed by a little break, then the answers, and then the all-important exciting raffle at the end. So I'm going to start you off with the general knowledge round. So if you're ready, we'll begin. Question one. The tallest building in the world is located in which city? The tallest building in the world is located in which city? Question number two. Which year was the original Toy Story film released in the US? Which year was the original Toy Story film released in the US? Question number three. Name the current UK Home Secretary. Name the current UK Home Secretary. Question number four. In 2017, the Best Picture Oscar winner was erroneously announced as La La Land, but who um, actually won the award? What was the film to win the award? In 2017, the Best Picture Oscar winner was um, incorrectly announced as La La Land, but which film actually won the award?
Question number five. What is the national animal of Scotland? What is the national animal of Scotland? Question number six. Uh, what is the capital city of Ukraine? What is the capital city of Ukraine? Question number seven. Which Shakespeare play included the famous stage direction, Exit Pursued by a Bear? Which Shakespeare play included the famous stage direction, Exit Pursued by a Bear? Question number eight. Which iconic English rock band are responsible for the 1967 hit song Waterloo Sunset? Which iconic English rock band are responsible for the 1967 hit song Waterloo Sunset? Question number nine. In which year was the popular video game Fortnite first released? In which game was the popular video game Fortnite first released? I think I might have said that weirdly. In which year was the popular video game Fortnite first released? Sorry, I'm not sure how many times I've said that now. <laughs> and um, finally, question number 10. The Social Network is a film about the founding of which major website? The Social Network is a film about the founding of which major website? All right, so um, that completes your general knowledge round. Um, hopefully I got most of those questions right, apart from a bit of fumble at the end. Um, questions will now go up on the screen, so if you've missed any, um, have a look out for them now. Uh, good luck with the rest of the quiz. I'll see you later for a few more rounds and the raffle at the end.
Okay, so this is your biology round. And there's 10 questions in this round and we'll start with question one. Hansen's disease is more commonly known by which name? Hansen's disease is more commonly known by which name? Question two, true or false, snails have teeth. True or false, snails have teeth. Question three, how many bones are there in an adult human body? How many bones are there in an adult human body? Okay, question number four. Who discovered penicillin? Who discovered penicillin? Question five. Crohn's disease is part of which disease group? Crohn's disease is part of which disease group? Question six. What is the name of the biggest part of the human brain? What is the name of the biggest part of the human brain? Question number seven. What food soup substance helps move waste through the body? Which food substance helps move waste through the body? Question number eight. Um, what is made by white blood cells to help fight off infection. What is made by white blood cells to help fight off infection? Question 10. A single piece of coiled DNA is known as what? A single piece of coiled DNA is known as what? And question 10, your last question of this biology round is animals that eat both plants and other animals are known as what? Animals that eat both plants and other animals are known as what?
Okay, we're just going to give you a couple of minutes just to go over your answers. Uh, we're now going to display the questions on the screen for you. Hello, next round with me is um, a geography round. So, when you're ready, uh, I'll start with question one. What body of water separates Africa and Europe? What body of water separates Africa and Europe? Question number two, what is the world's tallest waterfall? What is the world's tallest waterfall? Question number three, how many countries are there in Africa? How many countries are there in Africa? Question number four, which country has the most active volcanoes? Which country has the most active volcanoes? Question number five, uh, what are the five boroughs in New York City? What are the five boroughs of New York City? So this uh, question is worth five points if you get them all right. Question number six. Uh, what is the northernmost country in the world? What is the northernmost country in the world? Question number seven. Which Spanish, Spanish island is known as the Island of Eternal Spring? Which Spanish island is known as the Island of Eternal Spring? Qu 
question number eight. What river flows through the city of Paris? What river flows through the city of Paris? Question number nine, which ocean is Bermuda in? Which ocean is Bermuda in? Uh, last question for this round, question 10. The deepest trench in the world, the Mariana Trench, is located in which ocean? The deepest trench in the world, the Mariana Trench, is located in which ocean? That completes our uh, geography round. Keep your eyes on the screen for uh, the questions. If you missed any, uh, good luck with the quiz. I'll catch up with you later. All right, so this round um, is going to be uh, TV questions. There's a range of um, new to old, so hopefully it's going to appeal to um, everybody. Question number one. Ant and Dec first worked together on which children's TV drama? Ant and Dec first worked together on which children's TV drama? Question number two. What is the name of Miranda Hart's best friend in her hit sitcom of the same name? What is the name of Miranda Hart's best friend in the hit sitcom of the same name? Question number three. Um, who were the original presenters of Top Gear when it launched in 2002? Who were the original presenters of Top Gear when it um, was launched in 2002? So there's um, three points available for this one as well, for getting all three correct.
Question number four. In the Netflix show Stranger Things, who plays the character Eleven? In the Netflix show Stranger Things, who plays the character Eleven? Question number five. What is the name of, of the prison in the popular BBC sitcom Porridge starring Ronnie Barker? What is the name of the prison in the popular um, BBC sitcom Porridge starring Ronnie Barker? Question number six. What is the pub called in a Channel 4 soap opera Hollyoaks? What is the pub called in the Channel 4 soap opera Hollyoaks? Question number seven. Which actor played Rodney Trotter in Only Fools and Horses? Which actor played Rodney Trotter in Only Fools and Horses? Question number eight. Which entertainment show featured the phrase, tonight, Matthew, I'm going to be? Which um, entertainment show featured the phrase, tonight, Matthew, I'm going to be? Question number nine. Who does the voiceover for the UK version of Love Island? Who does the voiceover for the UK version of Love Island? And uh, finally, question number 10, uh, for what is actress Nancy Cartwright most famous for? For what is Nancy Cartwright most famous for? So there we go, that completes our TV question round. Uh, hopefully you enjoyed it. Um, good luck for the answers, which I will reveal to you later.
welcome to the final round of this week's quiz, which is a year specialist round, which was voted on um, via Facebook. And it's the guess um, what the food or the drink is from the ingredients on the screen. It's quite close, but that one won in the end. Um, so we've got 10 questions. Um, each question is either three or four different ingredients that make up either a food dish or a drink. Trying not to give too much away. All you need to do uh, for the point is to tell us um, what the food or the drink is that the ingredients make.
Okay, that's the end of the questions for this evening. We're going to take a quick five minute break now and we'll be back shortly to go through the answers.